guys welcome to our channel Sherry's innovations it's me Sharifa it's me Rifa so this is our new channel and we are the beginners in YouTube so we really need your sincere support and cooperation so can you say what are the specialities of this channel uh, I will be uploading some videos related to cooking recipes DIY crafts, some useful tips and some tech related videos Today what special video you are going to show to our viewers? As we are the beginners and it's our new channel so there is a saying like when we start uh, something uh, new we have to start with sweets. So today I will be uploading some sweet recipes. So before moving to our video please subscribe our channel, share, comment. If you like the video click the like button. Click the bell icon and enable all so you will receive the notification when you will upload our videos. So let's move to our video. So guys now we are going to make a simple mango cake recipe for that we need to line the cake tray using a butter paper so we have to cut the butter paper into the correct size of the baking tray now we need to grease the cake tray using some oil grease it all the sides of the cake tray now place the butter paper into it now the cake tray is ready for the cake so keep it aside now we are taking a juice mixer here we are not using any egg beater juice mixer is available with everyone at home so all can try it out this recipe so add two eggs into it add it one by one Okay, that's done. Now the next ingredient is half cup sugar. Sugar also we are adding as it is, no need to powder it. Now add half cup oil. Now here comes our main ingredient that is one mango. I have taken one full mango slice. Then a pinch of salt to balance the taste. Now blend it into fine paste. Now the paste is ready. So we can pour into the bowl. Okay, now it's time to add our dry ingredient. I have taken one cup maida flour. Add quarter teaspoon baking soda. half teaspoon baking powder now sieve it nicely you can sieve it two to three times it will give a good smooth and fluffy texture to our cake so that's done i have done only one time now take a whisk and fold it from one side gently it's very important step always when you are folding fold it from one side if you are folding from both side our text, uh, cake texture will be hard 
So now the battery is ready and this is our cons this is the consistency. Now we are pouring this batter into our cake tray. Okay, that's done. Now the main important step is you have to tap the cake tray three or four times to remove the air bubbles. Okay, so that's done. Now I have preheated my uh, saucepan. This is my oven setup. So I have preheated for five minutes in medium flame and keep a uh, stand inside. Now we can place the cake tray into it, close the lid and we have to close the hole on the lid, I have closed with a cloth. Now keep the uh, flame into lower the flame for 30 to 40 minutes now my cake is done I have to check whether it is fully cooked or not for that I have taken a skewer ok it's clean so the cake is fully cooked Now I'm cutting the cake and let's see how how is the texture. Yes, you can see it's very smooth, soft and fluffy cake. You see, it's very smooth. Now I'm going to taste this cake. Let's see how it tastes. Wow, it's yummy and delicious cake. It's fluffy and soft. The sweetness is great, so it's must try recipe. So, guys, welcome back again. And now, tell me, uh, how was my mango cake? Uh, it was simple, and with few ingredients, everyone can try it. It's so delicious cake. So, guys, please try it out this recipes. Now, thank you for watching our video. Stay tuned, tuned to our next videos. videos.